This is the moment that some of y'all have been waiting for. Uh, this is the world premiere. And I know in the advertising that happened, uh, this was a big point of promotion was in, I know that's the reason why a lot of y'all are here, was that you, know, you can be the first ones in the universe to hear this new, brand new song. And uh, I was inspired, as I often am, to, uh, to compose an ode, uh, especially for this occasion. Now, some of y'all are members of the Sanctuary <coughs> Choir. How many members of the choir do we have in here? <coughs> Got Jay, David? Uh, Mel used to be in the choir. I used to be in the choir until I got fired. I mean, uh, promoted to the Sanctuary. But um, the Sanctuary Choir <coughs> is going to be traveling to Vancouver, Canada uh, in December. When I heard about this choir trip, my mind started to go back, way back, to a choir trip that happened some years ago. And uh, during this trip, this, this choir had to endure many hardships and encountered uh, many detours along their intended route. Uh, in fact, they never performed at any of their scheduled stops, as it turned out. But in the end, they prevailed. And so I call this song, The Choir Trip to Nowhere. Now, by the way, uh, while I was composing the song, I invented three new chords. And I've patented these chords. They are F super sharp, G whiz sharp flat minor, <coughs> and B unnatural. Those are my three chords. And so anyone who happens to use those chords is supposed to send 25 cents to me, Garrett Grantham, P.O. Box 549, Golden Gap, Texas. So if you ever hear one of those chords, I need to know that. Okay, now let's move on with the song so y'all can get on out of here. And uh, once again, we appreciate your presence. The choir trip to nowhere. You ready, King Bob? The choir trip to the Rio Grande was a year in preparation. With jails and sewer road churches, the intended destination.
big moment. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna modulate. Right in the corner there. Oh no, I mean modulate on the guitar. Uh, Brother Thomas Tillman says that every song must modulate at least once. Now sometimes you can get away with a pseudo modulation. But y'all this morning I'm gonna give you the real thing. We're gonna strap on our modulators and uh, modulate on uh, uh, so bear with us while we make an adjustment here and now. Modulation has occurred. <coughs>